Hello everyone, welcome to another Let's Play, and yes, it is 2023. I always show the launch trailers for each of these games, although the dates may uh, have, you know, no longer be relevant. It's always good to sort of show how they pitch these games that have come to PSVR 2. Um, so I just want to say hello to everyone in the live chat. I can hear you in my ears. It's lovely to hear a nice uh, robot voice reading out your uh, messages. Um, but yeah, today we are going to be playing Pistol Whip by Cloudhead Games. They have just knocked it out of the park with this title, always adding content. I think I did buy this on PSVR, but just in case I didn't, I want to thank uh, Cloudhead Games for providing the PSVR copy. I will have to check that out. Um, but you do get a free upgrade uh, when you do move to PSVR 2 if you did buy it on PSVR. Um, what a joy this game is. I'm not particularly good at it because it's not just about going around shooting enemies uh, like John Wick. You've got to do it to the beat to get those combos, get those high scores. Um, but we're just going to have a bit of a play around and uh, have some fun. So without further ado, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about all future Let's Plays because I am on a mission to Let's Play every single PSVR 2 title out there. It's a big mission. And one I can't do alone, so I always appreciate the comments. If you're watching this on replay or if you're in the live chat, it's nice to have your company. Hit that like button and let's see if we can get to 50 by the end of the live stream. And away we go. Cloudhead Games are here. Lovely to have you here. I absolutely love Cloudhead Games because they are constantly spoiling the VR community with content. Um, even when Pistol Whip came to PSVR, it had already been out on other platforms for a while. And when it came to PSVR, it came with all the DLC included. And what I love is even from the start, you know, you know what I'm like, I like, you know, being able to customize so you can actually choose what gun you want. And there's quite a few pages. I mean, even some of these. Look at these. Super Soaker style. <laughs> but the one I think I had, it was this one. And I had it in teal. Because obviously teal is one of the two colours of Empathy Arcade. Um, so if we customise it. Uh, what we got? We got the colours here. I think that might be more of it. Oh, you can switch between darkness and light. Actually, I think that might be more of it. Um, like what's that one like? Oh, that's more like it. I think that's where we were. Um, and you can even choose the gunfire sounds. How do you... Oh, you reload like that. It's been a while since I've played this. Look at that. <laughs> Proper Gabba style. That's hench. We're going to go with that. Uh, anyway, so just showing you a bit of that. Save and exit. Close it. I love it. Wow. And uh, styles will become available after you complete some regular arcade scenes. Use these mods if you'd like to make the game more accessible. So lots of mods and that as well. Um, they've got so many different modes now. But um, first, we're going to jump into arcade. And let's just go with some of the classics. Black Magic. 
I mean, am I going to do hard? I'm going to... I can choose that on and off. It's, oh, okay. So let me know in the chat if this is your first time seeing this game. Oh, this is such a joy to play. So you'll see the score. You want to shoot to the beat. And the way the map pulses with the um, music will help you. And the closer to the beat you do it, the higher score you get. Let me know how the uh, sound mix is. Oh, that was stupid. I'm gonna have to do it though, it's my first go. <laughs> and you get those red lines. The only thing about PSVR 2 that I'm, makes me jealous of other platforms is, well, actually it's not to do with that, because I could do it. Oh no, I couldn't. I was going to say mixed reality. I mean, on this game, you just need me facing the other way, right? Maybe I'll do that on the next one. I'll face the other way. <laughs> Let's go. Cloudhead Games, if you're still there in the chat, I've got a question for you. Who's your biggest high scorer in the company? Oh, I died. Ah, oh, that was what you get for um, not paying attention. So what I'm going to do, actually, this might be completely ridiculous and not work. I'm going to turn around. How does this look? Does this look stupid? <laughs> Although I'm, I'm not in the middle, am I? But I think that's all right still. <laughs> it looks stupid. <laughs> okay, I'll turn around in a bit. Yeah, but because this has music to it, it works on the rails. Let's go.
I just love the sound when the bullets go past. That was a nice warm-up. New personal best. So I don't know if I've ever managed to get an S rank. And the amount of change, like the constant optimization with this game, with the HUD, is brilliant. Uh, you dodge the, the, the bullets as well, yeah. You, you dodge the enemy bullets, as well as the walls. Um, and you get these red lines if they're coming out of sight, so you do have this spider sense. Uh, right. Let's... Uh Ready to take it to the next level? Master the ins and outs of scoring, dodging, and armor recovery. You can find these tutorials at any time in training mode. Right, next up. We'll go. We'll do dual wielding. This could be fun. Well, I might end up not using him. Didn't even... Oh, yeah, my left hand is terrible. get health by actual pistol whipping. And I've just had a quick bit of dinner, <laughs> which included a banana, a potassium. Oh, that was stupid. See, as soon as I start talking, yeah, pistol whip is a must play. Obviously, compared to PSVR with the move controllers, it's superior. So, it makes a lot of games that you would have enjoyed. out the window. <laughs> oh! Yeah, my left hand was terrible. <laughs> Woo! I'm guessing a C. Okay, B. B's fine. Oh! I made it. 
just about. I feel like I should have maybe um, had the uh, had the um, heartbeat. Should we do it? Yeah, I know. I need to try and pistol whip. Um, do you know what? Just give me one second. I am just going to see if I can get this set up quickly. Um, let's have a look here. Here we go. I'm going to connect my Strom now. Here we go. Dashboard. Is it going to plug me straight in? Not quite. If I can remember my password. There we go. Okay, right. <laughs> okay, just one second now. Oh, God, I've got to feel it in my legs. I should have stretched before I did this. Uh, here we go. Let's just see if it syncs up. Just connecting it. <laughs> right, there we go. It's now connected. So you should start getting my heart rate. There we go. <laughs> right. Just so we can see how I'm getting on. Uh, this is what I love about the Apple Watch and with my setup. I normally do it for horror games because the horror games get my heart rate up, but why not do it with here? Uh, okay. What should we do now? The full. <sighs> Just gives me memories of Darth Punk. Absolutely terrible. <laughs> I should definitely have done my stretches. to go in circles. It's like a lot of VR games. Once you start getting into the flow of it, it just gets better and better. Just stop talking now, I'm gonna mess up.
<laughs> what was that? Someone was just flying around. Woo! Skyfish. B? Yeah, B. <laughs> That's fair enough. I mean, look, different games to different people. I mean, Pistol Whip is a game that I love when I'm playing it. And, like, playing it right now, I'm just like, why don't I come back to this more often? And they're just constantly adding content. They're constantly improving the UI and everything. Like, even just having the dual wielding as an option before you go into a mission. I remember the times when showing this ages ago. Although, unless, unless this has always been there, my understanding is it hadn't been, and you had to do it through the settings, like the modifier settings. And I always found myself when trying to show friends, like, how do you do dual wielding? Oh, I can't remember. Especially when they're in VR and you're trying to show them. Uh, right, let's go. Look at all these. So many. I'll rise above you. Part of marathon train, that's amazing. Right, let's go for this. Hi Priestess, I'll do that next. Just remind me at the end of this in case I forget. Whoa! against rules of engagement. <laughs> so as soon as you stop <laughs> panicking, you don't do it to the rhythm. going the wrong way. Woo! Let's do it again. That was out of time.
don't dance and mock me. Okay, what am I messing up? Am I going the wrong way or am I meant to shoot those walls? <laughs> that's cool, that's good to know about unlocking all the, the modes and stuff. <sighs> what was I doing wrong? Was I meant to shoot the walls or? Oh man, <laughs> you know what? Always, always stay hydrated, always stay hydrated. Always appreciate the devs hanging out, especially at a weekend. We'll come back to this one. Woo. <laughs> Priestess. Was it what you were saying? Which I think is a classic one. Or was it the second? Reloaded. High Priestess. Yeah. Let's do it. So 800 is the max score, right? Oh, I remember this one. Cloud, Cloudhead Games, how's it work with uh, Pistol Whip? If you buy the game, you get everything with it, right? Or are there packs? I think there's. I think you get it all together, but I don't want to be mistaken. Swap right when they come. That's a C. A, wow. Okay, I did a lot better than I expected. Woo. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. So good. Th good thing about the uh, aiming. So the aiming, it it does have aim assist. So it is more about you know to help with the fact that it's meant to be about doing it to the rhythm, but. You can have a modifier to, um, sorry, the, the reason I mispronounce some words is I start talking as stuff has been said in my ear and it can be distracting. Obviously, keep chatting. It's my problem to deal with. Um, but um, yeah, you can get a modifier for like, that's all about um, accuracy. Oh, right. Yeah, let's do a campaign. Although I was told if I do 10 of these. Ah, oh, this is my kind of tune. Let's do this. Random. So you can do random modifiers. No obstacles. Enemies don't shoot. 
all foes granted double armor. The score is determined entirely by accuracy. Turn enemies into abstract targets. That's super cool. But we'll reset. We're doing classic. But yeah, we'll, we'll do a campaign shortly. I've actually only done one of the campaigns. When the music's slow like this, that's when I find it harder to... I just felt feet of sweat. Yeah, yeah! People say... <laughs> You won't tell people it's aim assist, yeah. But it's not, it's not too, like, you saw when I was playing dual wielding, my left hand I was constantly missing, so you do have to shoot in the right direction. Well, let's see, I can't multitask. <laughs> that was terrible timing. Legs or the head, leg, see, leg, leg, head. So it is, so you can aim. Ah, oh. <laughs> right, I need to. One more go, one more go. I'll actually concentrate. <laughs> and thanks again for everyone who's tuned in. Don't forget to hit the like button. And I am currently doing my best to. Let's play every single PSVR 2 title out there. At this point, I think I'm at around 35. There's a playlist for them all, but if you want them in alphabetical order, I think you can actually shuffle the playlist that way. But on our Discord, which should be pinned in the chat, Empathy Arcade, or if you're watching on replay, it will be in the description. There is a Let's Play channel with every single Let's Play stream I've done in alphabetical order. So if there's a game that you want to have some insight on, beyond... Oh, I need to, I keep saying I'm going to start concentrating, I don't. But yeah, if you want to have a look at like gameplay, as you know, going beyond a review, then definitely uh, check them out. I've got, to, I've got to play a few more before I can play campaign. That's fair enough. Right, let's do... Um, I haven't done this one yet, mate. No! This is such a classic map. I was one trophy away from getting the Platinum on PSVR. But I think it was where you had to get a certain percentage or something. And I just couldn't do it. Disappeared. Ah! Oh. <laughs> One second, my uh, mat, my mat button is. You see that? That's in my mat to make sure uh, I'm in the middle, and it's all popped out. <laughs> it's hard doing it with pass through. But there we go. There you go. A bit of behind the scenes. 
I love all this stuff. I didn't want to lose that time. Discretion is advised. <laughs> I love that they're polite not to shoot in the back when you go past them. At least I don't think they do. I could be wrong. <sighs> Much better. Much better. B. B is my rank. <laughs> Unravel the story. Take me there. Here we go. Campaign mode. Here we go. Now, hard mode is tough. I am going to do normal just so that it's going to get a bit boring if I keep restarting. If you're hearing this, the crew of the CHGR Super cool, though. We followed a distress signal to an off world colony and found it plagued by the metal. A paradise. And what I love about this, although you won't be able to corroded. see it too much, but in VR, those images, they are 3D. In the terms of the layers. A trap. It took less than a cycle for the machines to turn our crew into a graveyard. I've stayed course for months in endless defense. Stacking scrap. Surviving by way of rations and rage. Tapping my legs so but now my patience is depleted. It's time to ditch this junkyard. It's time to prove what I'm made of. Such a cool intro. That beat. Took that like a champ. Things popped again on my thing.
Pistol Whip is another game I'm never showing friends and family. If you've never played VR before, this is a must. Just love that, depending on the enemy, you know when to double tap and that. Nothing wrong with easy mode. It's all about having fun. I died a lot on this when I was playing on hard. But for the sake of the let's play, a little bit of a challenge, but move through the levels as well. the level I got stuck on, I think, on hard mode. Out of here. Open your eyes. No gun. Damn, they took my ammo. <laughs> Guess this one's a brawl. There we go. I've always found with this, the best thing to do is to keep rotating in a circle. True pistol whip level.
Whew. Last one standing. Whew. Now to find some pants. <sighs> yeah, that was really difficult and hard, mate. They filled me with metal. They kept me alive. But why? Whew. I have to get to the compound to find answers. I'm Wait. definitely gonna need a shower off this the let's play before the leg. final one of the night. <laughs> I have this ammo. It seems to have a mind of its own. It's intelligent. Oh, wicked. Capable nice. Bursts. Burst. Metal mincer. Oh, wow. Feels awesome. Okay, this feels badass. Some people think there are strange creatures on Mars. Anyone watching who's never played this that thinks they might give this a go? When you kill them as they spawn, they still shoot. I can't hear the chat at the moment, so I have to check after this. That's good to hear, Wash. Sorry. Woo. We will comply. Get out of my head. I just love the way that they've we'll not just got a story with fine. levels, like you feel it's in the gameplay as well. I love that it does that as well. Hard mode.
Yeah, campaign was something that wasn't at launch. It was something they brought later. And there's a few campaigns, I believe. I think campaigns was an absolute genius move. Hello, welcome. How you doing? You've caught me in a very sweaty time. Fortunately, I'm wearing a, a very breathable Saiyan battle armor top. But yeah, after I've completed the campaign, we'll probably wait when I end the stream because I definitely need to shower and just take some time out before the final stream. Because after the previous one, which was uh, Operation Wolf Returns VR, or well, First Mission VR, I had 15 minutes to have my uh, dinner and then get ready for this. My fault, my fault. Bring it! Play this sitting down. I remember showing some of my dad's friends it, and they played it sat down. And they were like on a on a on a on a sofa, you know, leaning all the way across. Oh. It'd be cool if they had a boss. I wonder if they're going to have that in the campaigns. I don't know how that would work. Might not fit with the game's DNA, but who knows? Don't tell me if there is one, because I honestly don't know what happens in this campaign, and I do want the surprise. Oh, they do turn around with you. Oh. Hey Top Gunner, that message you sent was supposed to be super quickly, but I heard, am I going to get quest free? Um, possibly, no plans as of yet, to be honest, I don't even have time to play regular PS5 games at the moment. I've had um, God of War Ragnarok in my PS5, the disc in there for like 100 days, and I'm about 10 hours in, and I really want to continue playing it. Woo. That was brutal. What is this? My current deal. This is such a brutal story. The will wipe my memories. What? Our memories. No. It's oh. been using us for years. Memories. Learning from us. We are a research vessel for combat training. I have to break the cycle. Forgive me. No. Forgive yourself. I love this. The art, the art style on that. Simple but super awesome. You wiped my memories? It's not possible. Why are you doing this? Yeah, Karina, welcome. To heat our transmission failed to produce viable data until yours. We eradicated life from the in search of you. I don't understand. You put a gun yeah. in my leg. This is it. You know, some people say VR is all about realism. VR for me is in part that, but it's also about experiencing different things, going to different worlds. It's all about sensory. Keeping me alive with your last mistake. Sensory treats, as I call them. Oh, is this the boss? Oh yes. Amazing. 
Oh, this is super cool. I didn't know in Pistol Whip they'd have a boss. And I hope they did. This is amazing. Whoa! Shit, I need to use them to get help. Now, is that timed? Yeah. Like perfect for shutting your ass down. Let's go. Come back. Come back. Whoa. let you know you only take damage when it hits your head so if you're wondering why it's not slicing my body in half that's why because that would be a bit mean well ah oh. lost concentration <laughs> all right you wiped my memories it's not possible i'm not going to say i'm going to concentrate this time because when i say that i end up not but hit the like button people it's my energy. How many likes are we on right now? 50 is the goal. I don't understand. You put a gun in my leg. Yeah, playing this on PSVR 2 more. I'm like, I need to come back to this a lot more. I'm not you. Not yet. Keeping me alive. Especially as a part of a workout routine, you could say Monday's a Beat Saber, Wednesday's a Pistol Whip, you know. Oh yeah, Summer Sale coming up. No, those ones in front of me I need to save. Your species is a redundancy. You are the perfect human. Yeah. Perfect for shutting your ass down. Let's go. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, okay, just follow you around. You need to keep moving around. Whoa! The music's pretty chilled on this. It's very misleading. Come on. Why won't you die? Whoa. It's over 9,000. Whoa. No, I needed to save that one in the middle. Whoa! No! Those middle ones I need to stop killing! I actually... I'm gonna die! I'm caught up in the cable!
thank you. Surely that should stop their guns when you shoot the thing out. Oh. Why am I breathing so heavy? I thought I was a cyborg. It's done. Without the core to power it, the metal will die by dawn. I will last longer. Perhaps long enough for a ship to cross this hellscape once more. Perhaps long enough to find home again. Perhaps not. The sunset here isn't so bad. Professor John H. Asimov, signing off. Amazing. What an amazing campaign. I do have Lay Mills body combat. Amazing. Thank you so much, Cloud Head Games. I'm just going to read it out. Amazing. Be quick. Awesome running. Celebration and completing the 2089 campaign. Here's a little first come, first serve treat for the chat. An EUK key for pistol whip on PSVR or PSVR 2. Enjoy, heroes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Very, very, very kind. And keep up the great work because something when it comes to conversations around, you know, the VR games we love, sometimes there are VR games that have great, you know, core mechanics, are really fun, but they're short-lived. You complete it and you're like, but why would I want to do it again? And the fact that you keep adding content, and not just adding new levels, but doing campaigns and things like that, uh, is just amazing. And I just love that you keep supporting this game. Um, and absolutely, so if you saw this, and you like what you saw, this is how we support an industry still in its infancy. You know, support the devs that are making the games that you love so they can keep making more of them. Not just more games, but more content as well. <laughs> Too slow. Ah, well, they do go very quickly. Um, but once again, thank you, Cloudhead Games, for that. Whew. I just want to hear this music. So good. And there we go. There we go. And then they've got also Smoke and Thunder. And there we go. So we have the campaign and we have contracts. That's like uh, daily missions. Um, and it all comes from playing this. You can play the individual levels as well. I just love the posters and the artwork. Smoke and Thunder Encore. Stay tuned, there's much more excitement to come. They just keep adding to it. More and more. So here are the modifiers. So you can do Brawler only. So you can do a level with just melee. You can do Burst Fire, which is obviously what we were using then. Boomstick. Double Barreled. Look at that. Super cool. And revolver, six shooter. Yay, we got a winner from Titty Sprinkles. Well done, well done. Hope you have an amazing time with this. We've also got rhythmic, so score is determined entirely by timing, score is determined entirely by accuracy, and turns enemies into abstract targets. You can do dual wielding. So you could do dual wielding like burst fire. <laughs> or revolvers. Uh, I mean, that's badass. And then look at all these. Nothing can stop you. You got all this. Heavies, all foes granted double armor. Headshots only. Bullet health. So many bullets. Do you know what? Let's just have some fun. Let's end on something absolutely ridiculous.
Right, here we go. So we're going to do bullet hell, double armor. Your bullets ricochet so they come back at you. I am going to do it so I'm bulletproof. So we're just going to go through it. It's just going to be ridiculous. Um, see, there you go. Dead eye. Aim assist disabled. Penalty for missed shots. Um, shuffled enemies. Uh, headshots only. Enemy. Okay, enemy bullets travel faster. What were those ones up there? Low velocity. They have big heads. Let's do big heads. Uh, and we're going to do boomsticks. Double boomsticks. Actually, can we actually... Oh, here we go. Look at this. These are all... Let's, let's do it with these. And let's customise. Let's do it in the Empathy Arcade colour. Wish you could do one of each. One of each colour. Although, maybe we can. Oh. Do you know what? I actually think the wrap... If we do red, and then the metal we do teal. There we go. I mean... Oh, this looks like Empathy Arcade style. I think this will do. And then the metal can be the red. Right. And then, oh yeah, there's only one sound effect. <laughs> Alright everyone, we're going to end the stream with something ridiculous. I can't die, but any bullet I shoot is going to come back at me. They look like massive carrots. <laughs> Do you know what? I'm going to take out the I can't die. What fun is that? Forget about reloading. Your armor regenerates faster and can sustain more damage. There we go. Okay, this is going to be absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> there has to be a threat. Whoa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe I, w I should do it without. Everyone's got double armor. I've always got to assume the bullets are coming back my way because when I hit him. end it there <laughs> listen everyone 
I want to say a huge, huge thank you. Oh, there you go. Contracts. So you get weekly raids. You get challenges monthly, weekly, and daily. And then your career overall with an average rank. It's super, super cool. So, there we have it all. Pistol Whip. This is a must play on PSVR 2 or any VR headset for that matter, unless you're looking at this and shooting isn't your thing. But the fact it has rhythm with the music, you can play it at much slower paces and you have modifiers so you can be invincible, um, that, that, that enemies are easier. So you're always going to be able to play something that is um, in line with your ability and what you want to do is have fun. Well, I need to have a shower. <laughs> and uh, have a little lie down before the final let's play of today but I want to thank everyone in the live chat who has kept me company as always uh, huge congrats to our winner uh, for the game key of Pistol Whip and of course a huge thanks to Cloudhead Games for spending this last hour and 15 minutes with me um, really really appreciate it I love that the devs who get involved with the community um, I'm sure it's always nice for them to see people inside their worlds getting sweaty and horrible <laughs> and also a thank you to my mods Karina thank you for keeping the chat nice which it always is anyway but it's a testament to this amazing community and if you're watching and you're new why not stick around for future let's plays and my weekly talk show Miles Dyer live every Wednesday subscribe ring the bell to be notified about all future shows and hit the like button on the way out and if you have played Pistol Whip or you get it after this live show I love hearing from you. So let me know your thoughts in the comments section below and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye.